What up, y'all? Let's get to 39 here. My humble abode, you know. It's another My Thoughts video. I'm drinking my coffee. I'm lounging. You know what I mean? I ain't lounging as comfortably as I like the lounge because y'all can't see all that, you dig. But, uh, basically, my thoughts today is on my hair. Now, the reason I'm doing all my thoughts on my hair is because I'm sick and tired of people coming at me like, you gonna cut your hair? Uh, Yes, if I feel like I want to cut my hair, I'm going to cut my hair. It don't matter how long it is, so what? If I decide to cut my hair, it's my own free will. And the reasons that I might cut my hair is because not only am I pursuing a music career, I'm pursuing another career in addition to that. So that whichever one I'm successful in, the other one will be my backup plan. I'm going to be wise about my stuff, you feel me? I'm not going to be stupid about it. So many artists out here, especially with the way stuff is now. So many people, just in general, be on that stupidity. Oh, I'm going to do this and that's it. And then when it don't happen, then you stuck. That ain't going to be me. Feel me? I had some things over my head before that kept me from making the possible decisions and moves I want to make. But that ain't the case no more because God, you know, has blessed me. And made me able to move forward in my other endeavors that I want to pursue. Um, and the other endeavors I want to pursue, in addition to music, is either being in the Navy, or a police force, or a firefighter. Now, which one, whichever one of those three take off for me first, and that's what I'm going to go with. If I become a firefighter, I might not have to cut my hair. But if I do the, the Navy... Navy Swick or Navy Corman, there's no getting around it. You gotta cut your hair as part of the occupation. Plus, having long hair, being in the military or being the police, it could be an occupational hazard. Plus, as long as my hair is, I'm not trying to take 45 minutes to an hour every day fixing that up, especially if I was in training the boot camp. Come on, that's stupid. Nah. So, if any of you people out there got a problem with the fact that I might cut my hair, if that's going to make you like me any less, not listen to my music, not watch my videos, disassociate yourself with me, then you was never really on my side to begin with. My hair does not make the man that I am or am not. I'm still going to be the same man I am, regardless of my physical attributes. Because the people that we are is not this what you see. That's for right now. That's why we're here. It's called imagery. It's physical imagery. We are all souls. We are souls and this is just a flesh shell. This is just our, our casing while we're in this world, okay? So, I don't care if you don't like the fact that I might cut my hair. So what? If I lose all my fans uh, when it comes to my music because I cut my hair, then they was never really fans to begin with. So if you got a problem with this video, you can go ahead Unsubscribe right now. You can go ahead, unlike my Facebook pages. You can go ahead, um, unfriend me from whatever account you're friends with me on. You can go ahead, get off my website, all that. And you can send me a message letting me know that that's why you did it. So I'll know who the shallow ones are. Because if you get mad at this video and do it anyway, I'm going to figure out who you are. And that's what I'm going to think anyway. So if there's any other reason, you might as well be clear. Be honest. Be real about it. Flat out. Um, just like, it's, and, and the same thing goes for like people saying that, I, that I'm a sellout because I don't live in the hood no more. Who the hell wants to live in the hood the rest of their life? I moved up out of Baltimore City. Mad love, 410 till I go, you feel me? But I'm not trying to go back, neither is my wife. I'm a grown man. I'm almost 30 years old. I'm trying to make sure that me and my wife are good to go no matter what. So... That means I got to do something, make some changes, make some image changes, make some mental changes, some spiritual changes, some, uh, you know, in a positive direction so that we are good, so that God honors that and God blesses us. Oh, yeah, so be it. 
y'all want to all be saying YOLO, you only live once, your dog all right. I'm not going to be saying YOLO, you only live once, doing reckless stuff. I only live once, so I'm going to make the best of it. You feel me? Um. So yeah, that, that that's that's my thoughts on my hair. If I'm okay with it, then you should be fine with it. Don't sit here, oh my god, this is so what? Who I ain't impressing nobody but myself, my wife, and God. I don't care what any of you think about me and how I look. That's partially why I do the kind of music I do. I speak my mind. And when I don't I'm when I'm not able to get in the studio and write it out. I do this, I do my thoughts, and I keep it 160% real with you. It is what it is. Take it or leave it. It ain't gonna change. The only person I gotta answer to in the end when I close my eyes is the Father. And I know there's some stuff I gotta answer for. I know this. I'm man enough to admit it. But, uh, you know, forgiveness is wonderful. You know, be angry and sin not. I'm angry that y'all keep running your mouths to me like uh, about my hair. It's hair. Even if I don't make a career out of the Navy, I make a career out of police force, go in there, serve my time, come out, I can grow my hair back. Hair loss don't run in my family. Thank the Lord for that. Feel me? So, it's early in the morning. It was on my mind. So, that's my thoughts, and uh, I'm still drinking my coffee. And uh, my Navy recruiter is supposed to be here soon, so that's why I'm lounging in my clothes and just waiting. I'll go out here and uh, give him a call in a few minutes. And you know, even that, you know, I'm still finding out information, but. You know, I'm gonna keep y'all posted. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let y'all know what's up. You know, it's my thoughts. I don't care. I do not care if you do not agree. You feel me? <laughs> I don't care at all. My thoughts. Yeah. You know, I, and I don't. You know what? I don't even care that I just messed up my words a little bit because I'm sleepy. I'm still waking up. It's early in the morning. It's about like. I'm um, probably 7.30, 8 o'clock in the morning. I've been up since 4 this morning. I wake up in the morning with my wife every day. Cause she's in the military. I see her off to work, you know. Shout outs to my wife. I love you, baby. And shout outs to everybody who, who follows me and listens to what I talk about and listens to the music I do. Genuinely. If I stop giving you a physical image that you can look at, and I just give you sound, then what you going to do? And I pop up and I look completely different. You ain't going to recognize me. The point is, to this whole thing, even though I'm using myself as an example, stop focusing on the physical so much. This physical body, your physical body, it's going to die one day. The only thing that matters is your heart and soul, because that's what lives on. Your heart, spirit, mind, your soul, everything that is internal, that is who you are. All this, this, this crap, this, so what? It don't. So, it don't matter. And as far as fashion's concerned, I wear what I like. I really don't care about fads and fashion anymore, for real. As long as I feel I look good, and I'm matching, I'm coordinated, and my wife thinks I look good, and, she's, and, and I'm pleasing to her eye because that's how a husband is supposed to be. And vice versa. No problem. She's accepting the fact that I might have to cut my hair. So all of you listening and watching, get over it. That's my thoughts for the day. I'm going to go eat some breakfast now and drink some more coffee. I'll let you